Okay, so when I was uh, looking into like starting to dread my hair, there's a lot of videos on how to do it, um, how long it would take, um, you know, just what hundreds of different methods there are and all that stuff. But one thing that I really didn't see was, um, you know, how does it, how does it like the hairstyle affect your lifestyle? You know, like if you are a tattoo artist or something in the the arts department for your job you know it's probably just gonna add character or a stylistic um, look to you that people will be able to identify whereas if you are studying accounting and you have to you know look good for job interviews it's I don't know it's it's almost impossible to have the hairstyle and to to stay in that world. For me, um, I do like video photography stuff like that. Um, so my clients sometimes are in the skateboarding world, sports, surfing, and then sometimes they're in like the architecture, commercial, um, like venue where you have to look professional, and. Um, so for me, I never go to a shoot with my hair down. This just doesn't look professional and it doesn't give the, the you know, business look that I want. So I just pull my hair up and away. And I don't know, because I have dark hair, it seems to all blend together. Hold on one second. Okay, I'm back. So, um, yeah, it's... It's, uh, I put my hair up like this, and like I said, since I'm brunette, it, it's sometimes a little harder to see, although the tips of my hair are kind of like highlighted from the sun. So normally I'd go like this, and then I'd put it into a bun, making it kind of tight, and then this hair would usually wrap around and then stick back in if I can get it yeah it stick back in like this so this is kinda loose but this is how I'd show up um, to work and you can't really tell so let me darken this a bit Okay. so um, you can do it you can maintain a professional look um, and if anything, you know, you could put like a little bit of hairspray down or, you know, something to, to, to calm down the frizziness. Um, and most people really won't notice. They just assume you're on the man bun trend and that's it. So, um, you can do it. Um, for me, you know, it's, um... It wasn't a make or break type situation. Um, if there's, you know, if I was uh, studying like medicine or, you know, somewhere where it had to be a very, very clean environment, um, this look doesn't lend itself for people to have, you know, a lot of confidence, even though it's, that's not fair. Um, they don't have a lot of confidence in you because they see things first and then they get to know you second. So, um, if you are thinking about getting dreadlocks, um, definitely take the, the extra steps to, um, maybe like calm down the frizziness, put it in a real tight bun and, um, and hopefully it works out. That's really all I can say. Um, so, if you're thinking about looking into having dreads and your field may be weary of it, um, it can be done, but it may have some, some complications. So, yep, there you go.